Hello, and welcome back to part 21 of my Total War Warhammer 2 Let's Play with Reichland, Cult of Sigma. This is part 21. Last time we defeated the Dark Elsia, a very Pyrrhic victory. And uh, we're gonna go back inside next turn to recruit more units. But first, let's recruit a, um, a disciplined, maybe. Hmm, ooh, Regal would be useful for this area. But this, it's only plus two, it's not all that good. But aggressive is quite powerful. No, we're gonna get a regal guy. Curtis. Curtis Hammerheim. Ready? Congratulations, you get accusation, which I finally figured out how it works. It's actually, uh, it doesn't do any damage at all, it just reduces, <laughs> so it's missile resistance, armor, and melee defense, so, yeah. Let's give him, uh, Melee attack and melee defense. Actually, probably he's not supposed to get into melee just yet. His melee defense is quite. Def yeah, his melee defense is, an is abysmal. His melee stats are abysmal at the moment, so let's improve that. Start improving his melee defense. Ready. Give him they some equipment. Uh, we don't have any equipment to spare. This could be useful, but let's give him the Brass Cleaver instead, so that all allies in range are improved. Give him the Dawnstone. The Chrono Command. Winds of Magic Power Reserve would be useful. I think it's for the entire army, so it doesn't matter if he has it or someone else has it. And just put whatever we can find here. This army is on its way to go help him out. So let's send him up here. Uh, hey, yeah, let's go into the skills. More points into Doom and the Darkness. Let's increase the music sound a little bit, it's a little bit quiet. Uh, these are the new locations we got. Uh, let's go with the, the income. That's the one we're doing. We don't have enough money for that. We could improve. Nothing at the moment. We're, we are too poor. Yeah, we're too poor to afford anything at the moment. Where is the Emperor? Carl Franz is on his way up here. Yes, righteous fury upon. Them. And we had two Receive. warrior priests going up to meet these guys, right? If I can remember. Sir, you summon me. Not the um, yeah, Gilt's also on his way. Wind of shadow, I, will. <laughs> I had some warrior priests here. Cleanse the empire. Yeah, this one here. Yeah, he was going up there too. Yeah, they're all going to here to help them replenish. And I have a second one where I don't remember where he is at the moment. If I go checking for my heroes. So, Not this guy. What do you Not require? this guy. Okay, it's this guy here. Yeah, he's on his way to join. That way we can offset the, the the replenishment debuff. See you after the end turn. Okay, we're back, and uh, Durthu was trespassing through our lands quite a bit. My potential. There is power within prayer. Yes, there is. Now go talk. Now go get up here to help out. For Stodbringer, and these are just gonna stay around here for a while, recovering and waiting for their battle priests to get there. Move. 
we'll deal with those Skaven if we ever have to. I hope we don't, but if it happens, we just fight them and win. Not much we can build here. No. Where? That improves income as well. I keep losing track of the battle priests. Here they are. This one's gonna go get up here and get to Volkmar's army. Yes. Faction counter sentinels of Zeti. Yeah, okay, they're down there. Okay, the Dark Elves here didn't really move much. Praise be to Sigma. So we can just defeat them. Their army isn't much. Yes. No threat. Looking ahead, protector yep. of the weak. Drill! Get those guys in there. Here to serve. Can we Ever onward. Can we go all the way up there and then back? Death yes, we can. To the faithless. Now if I do this, I'm pretty sure I'm gonna lose someone on in the auto resolve, so I think we're just gonna have to fight it in order to get rid of that army. These are pistoliers. These handgunners are pretty high level, I don't want to lose them. So let's start this with a quick pointless battle. Well, we'll just use our heroes as frontline units. Fayaz is going to get shot to pieces. But these new Scourge Runner's chariots are getting really annoying to deal with. As if all the armor piercing that the Dark Elves have wasn't already dangerous enough. Mm. Hand okay, I think the audio might be a little bit Ready too loud now. War. The Black Lions, which I think are a war wagon with a Hellblaster volley gun. Yes. They're the only one of its kind. Sterling's Revenge! Sterling's Revenge is going to be obviously in front. With... Swordsman. Everyone else. Of the Empire. You guys are the front line. Ready ammunition! Pistoliers! Yeah, you guys are also technically front line. No, you guys are outriders, but yeah. Okay. Both of them are going to are going to drink their potion. I do not fear death. Move them forward. In the Emperor's name. Drink up. Drink up. On fire. Shoot. Go. Let's act quickly. For the twin tail coming. Yeah, that's this here is the scourge on our chariot. Yeah, it ha oh, it's actually pulled by horses, not uh, cold ones. I thought it was pulled by cold ones. They're shooting giant uh, spikes out of it. Giant pikes. What are you guys doing standing there getting shot at? Okay. Move forward. Shoot this guy from the chariot. You guys. Kill her. That didn't. That did almost nothing. Piercing bolts of burning. Great against single target. You guys sure you're gonna? Okay. Is it gonna open? Yeah. Okay, our generals are fighting. Yeah, it sounds a little bit too high. And let me just turn it. Make it a little bit lo less loud. Eh, like that. Buff him up. Debuff. And we've won. She terror routed off the field. Uh, or, well, we don't need to follow her. Her entire faction is. Her entire faction, her army is dead. We lost relatively few people. No one got wiped out. 
then we can just go and replenish our army. <laughs> and continue our crusade into Norska while we wait for the game to end. Yeah, they die. Okay, go back in here. We have some replenishment, not much. Yeah, we might need to build a replenishment building here soon. We don't need mages from here. We can get a replenishment building instead. By Sigma. We're not really supposed to hold any of these places. We're just here because, well, it's, I thought it would be fun to fight dark elves. We're quite poor at the moment. Alright, oh, because I keep using my money on building upgrades. Of the weak. Nah, it's no. not going to be a threat to anyone. I will not. Oh, that army there is a threat to Lord of these guys because they don't have good armies. But I think Durthu or Orion might take care of that. Yes. Welcome, son of mighty Sigma. Okay, do you want what to... What you have of the king in the woods? Do you want to join this army? Of course. Good, now if we attack something, you join us. They're making armies, but none of them are being sent to stop our... The Empire. Our armies are not being stopped. The instrument of Sigma's will. I am ready. Are you? More armies to attack Norska. We will. How should we proceed? Oh, I forgot. I completely forgot about this. I was attacking the, the Gel's right graveyard, right? Yeah, I was. For the best. Onwards. Okay, let's take care Huntsman of that. of the Empire. You guys are at war with a lot of people. How much? Okay, they have one stack on Ulthuan, but uh, nothing protecting their actual capital, so. Schemer, unreliable, ag aggressive, naval aggressor. Okay, everybody loves us, and everybody either hates them or doesn't care, care about them. And we have our reliable ally in the form of the dwarves. Let's not drag anyone else into this war. They will fall! Seek! Destroy! We can just auto-resolve this. But, uh, yeah, because of the attrition. Fight with clout, comrades! Because of the attrition, we might take some damage. Let's, uh... Let's, Let's fight them ourselves. Let's get this done! The Necrofex Colossus. A Colossus walking a colossal walking frame of a galleon in torn timber, iron and and flesh resistlessly driven by a, a vortex of deathly energy. Firewalls moving, armor piercing, armor armor piercing missiles, armor piercing causes terror, one of the most annoying units in the entirety of the game if it's spammed. But if it's just one like it's currently here, it's not a problem. And everyone here is immune to psychology anywho, so yeah, not a big deal. Now, we'd like to use our cavalry to try and get rid of their artillery. If only there was a force they could hide in. Like, maybe this one here. Yeah, that's a good place for them to hide. Marina, guide our aim. We can just train up with our, for with our reinforcements here. Marcus, Watch your back. Let's put our Great troops sword. like this. Hold the high ground if we can. Even here on the high ground. Marcus Wolfhart can go in front for now. Yes, sir. Everybody sir. gets guard mode. Including you. Light wizard. And let's start a fight. Now that's where the artillery is. We get to get our general and our captain. 
As long as they don't find these guys, we can charge into their artillery and stop them from firing. This army isn't much of a threat, but it's a cool location. Look, there's a, a tornado back there. And the moon. Quite a lot of de quite a lot of destroyed ships and giant pieces of bones and stuff. It looks cool. Okay, we have our Hellstorm rocket batteries. Let's organize our new army here. Swordsmen. The Empire endures. Ready, General. You guys can join up with them. Go. Ready. Both gunmen can go here. Yes, my lord. Ready to fire. Great swords. You guys can uh, help defend the zone. They are actually holding their ground. As soon as we're in position, we'll just move forward. Okay, none of their units are fast enough to actually catch up to the Demigriff Knights. So let's try and get the Demigriff Knights around there. Oh, but they can shoot them. Ugh, I'm getting a call, wait. Okay, sorry for the interruption. Let's continue. Let's move forward a bit. Try and shoot their mortars down if we can. Let's get all these guys into one group. Get them over there. Do an arc of Ish. Move everything forward a little bit. They are moving forward themselves. Okay, let's just re let's just recognize this entire mess. Missiles will fly. Take it in. I think that's all of our missile units. Yes, sir. Quickly, Sigma calls. Help with theirs. Swordsmen, sir. How good have we been doing a job against the artillery? Decent. Fire into them. Move out of there. Can just get out of there. Let's um, trap them here. Okay, we might lose a few handgunners here. Yes, sir, quickly! Hmm. A banishment here should take care of them. Okay, trip one out there. Send us out. Get our frontline units to charge in. Right about now. After you guys, charge into there. And you guys, charge into them. Get our Luminar for safety. I don't want to lose it. These two demon guys out of here. Okay, those guys to charge back in. Everyone kill the Necrofex Colossus. You guys intermeddle with the archers. Yeah, Necrofex. 
I mean, another uh, Luminok. We need a buff here. Let's get Marcus Wolfhard into a place where he can actually fight well. Cavalry out of there. Mortar. And we've won. I don't think anybody got wiped out. That's that was my but Behold the silver hammer. Okay, yeah. When will the last enemy drop? There we go. Decisive victory. Nobody gets wiped out, I think. I'm I'm bad at fighting on weird terrain actually. That terrain is really Difficult for me to fight on. Henry Sharp Eye. These trophies are ours. We could raise it, but uh, let's occupy it instead. Let's loot and occupy. There's no reason to not loot it. Loot and occupy this place. Comrade ship is all. Yes, it is. Pervious to attack. Locked and loaded, and then the rest of his line. Van, Ho Van Horstman, isn't that the that that light college traitor? Traitor who became um, a chaos sorcerer. Okay, they should now be taking... Yeah, they're taking attrition. So now they're going to be pressured to attack. And this army is right here. It's not all that good. It has... These guys are good at holding the line and this is level on the real damage, but... Not a good ratio. Okay. Let's go back to our army up there and uh, recruit some more units. Sigmarite Arch Lector. We need a we need a few more units for our front line. No, we don't need these uh, pistoliers. They are not armor piercing and they're not all that good. Praise be to Sigmar. That should be a decent enough front line. These guys can hold. Should we proceed? We now own this place. Uh, host Festag. Get that. So that we have no more attritions from Maelstrom and Reef and yeah, Reef and Maelstrom attrition. And this place will stop being corrupted soon. My arrow flies through. Let's um, boost our income. The nation calls. Made this guy a little bit better at fighting. Improved Skaven Blight, good. Now it's finally at max level. And I think that if we keep these Skaven Towers, this will basically be impossible to take. Because t because Skaven Towers are extremely powerful. Nothing we can do here. Yes, General. Our faith. Yeah. See you, in the, see you after the end turn. Where hopefully our crusade against Norska will continue. Well, something happened uh, right now. Uh, the Wood Elves of Athalorn declared war on the Dwarves, and we had to help out the Dwarves. Luckily, we're not unreliable, but unfortunately, uh, we're going to have to start invading Athaloran, and all my armies are very far away. Well, the Dwarves declared war on them. I don't know who started it, but uh, it's the War of the Beard Part 2. Let's not uh, make any more allies here that aren't part of the forces of order. I will hear what you have who are you? Oh god, what is he what is Count Noctilus doing here? Not a back no, screw you. Okay, let's uh migration. Yeah, let's welcome the migration. Okay, yeah, these guys. Karl Franz. 
That's a decent army, but it's not gonna... Oh, because it fought against the Norskin one, okay. Yeah, we are still... Yeah, we're still very high reliability, so... Well, I guess we have something new to fight. Geld, Franz, make your way down here. It's gonna take the Dwarves at least a little while to get there, so... Yeah, probably a good idea to start trying to make our way down there. Yes. So that we can fight against the against the wood elves as well. Now, where are our our battle priests? They're at the very bottom. Okay, those are the guys that are constantly stationed at Skaven Blight. This guy's almost there. March. By the comet. There is power within prayer. March. Okay, let's bring Volkmar over a bit faster. Just so they can join up a little bit quicker. We can get rid of one of these battalions here, like this uh Who here is the least important? Uh like this um, this great sword here, mate. No, this uh, crossbowman here. He's not all that important. By Sigma. Let's improve replenishment rate. True servant of Sigma. But of course, we can just uh, replenish on Ulthuan if we want. Champion of the faith. It's probably faster to try and replenish in Ulfu on Ulthuan. And from there, launch our invasion onto Nagarond. Guided by Sigma. Yeah, much faster. So let's just stay there on, on Ulthuan for a bit and recover. True servant of Sigma. That army can't be much of a threat to anyone. Continue making our way up here. And now we have a new war to fight against the Wood Elves. I think we have enough money for one more army. Okay, let's recruit a tough... Or... Hmm, strong is... Aggressive is plus 10%. Okay, we don't need a tank as much as we could use a damage dealer. Let's recruit a tough guy. Give him the Bard Warhorse, this, this, and this. Safeguard. Wild eyed. Impassionate. Face Bastion. Tenacity. Good. Let's recruit a. Um, what type of. We're recruiting all the generals here. If that affects the army, we want a monster tracker. We'd like to have. Um, defense. Attack. Post Seeker, Scarred Veteran. Disciplined would be good. Yeah, Disciplined would be good. Ready. Accusation, Elusive, Silver Bullets. And the Battle Major of what would be good against the... What's good against the Wood Elves? Ooh, a knowledgeable fire wizard would be good, but we've already have enough fire wizards. We have uh we haven't used the Lore of Heavens much. So let's use a Lore of Heavens guy, but first we should probably recruit one of these guys because what it's good. You yeah, you're gonna go back to yeah, I want you to go to Marienburg. Let's give him boost income, scouting, specialist, and whatever else we can find. His job is to go to Marienburg. Let's recruit a better one. Now a battle wizard. We'd like to have a celestial one. Confident or aggressive. Confidence better. What is your wish? Let's give him harmonic convergence, wind blast, curse of the midnight wind, an imperial pegasus, chain lightning, comet of Cassandora, and more comet of Cassandora. We could also have two wizards in the army, but that would be a weird choice. 
Okay, yeah, um, which general should we use? We can recruit an... Can we... Okay, we don't have the income to recruit a new one. So let's recruit um, someone we... Is Nicholas Pappenheimer available at the moment? Yes, he is. He can finally return to the field. After all these years. The Let's ask the dwarves for some money. After all, we have a war to fight. What can I do for you? You could give us some money for the war efforts. Yes. Thank you. It is time. You could also I give me some money I for the war elf. Some call me a king. You are welcome here. Oh, we need money for the new war efforts against the dark, against the all wood elves. Right. It is time. At your service. Okay, yeah, everyone's at war with the wood elves now. What do you wish to discuss? Tyrion, I'd like some money. Understood. Thank you, Tyrion. Anyone else want to give me some money? Thank you. We're just going, we're just going door to door asking people for money at this point. Thank you, Master Mundi. Land folk are weak. Yeah, yeah, whatever. Cetra, want to give me money? Thank you. Wow. Cetra actually gave me money. At your service. And yeah. Oh god, you're at war with everyone. Forget it. You're dead. Luther Harkon. Well, let's burn down the Orc of Ages then. Yes, my lord. Let's get some... Um, Illuminarch of Hish. Some, some great swords. And some huntsmen. Then we can get uh, the Emperor's Wrath. Eldritch God, because I know they might have Wild Riders. Then we can go a few. We can go up here and recruit two Hellstorm rocket batteries, a uh, Hellblaster volley gun, and some hand gunners. What does the Emperor bid? Those armies should be ready soon. But yeah. What el war with the Wood Elves it is. More income. More income. Actually, wait. The legendary building. Yeah, it would help. Quite a lot, actually. Now we're also at war with the Vampire Coast from there. Let's just bring everyone over there. These guys I'm gonna get for. Alethanar is here. Good to see Alethanar alive. Yeah, we don't have yeah, much to do. See you after the end turn. Okay, we're back. Franz and Gelt are moving to towards the zone, towards the area. Let's uh, stop taxing this place for a while so we can improve our public order. Get him there quick. Step to it. It is time. Two more infantry units. We are on our way to Nagarond. And now we need to fight the Wood Elves. Oh yeah, they have quite a lot of armies. With Durthu. Durthu is very strong, so... His Lord Defeat, his Lord Defeat trait isn't anything special, though. So that's unfortunate. Okay, as soon as this place is stable, we leave. Okay, she actually defeated them. So I guess to Ulthwan... So I guess we have to go to Ulthwan again. Go up there. So I guess we have to make another trip to Ulthuan. Okay. What? 
cleanse the empire. Almost there. Let us forge our faith. Chosen of Sigma. Get them over here so they can then Ooh, Throg is here. Building up a new army. Nice. That's That would be fun if Volkmar could get to him. Is it time? Where did he go? This one of them, where'd the other one go? Isn't he very close to Volkmar at the moment? Oh there he is. Yes. Blessings of Sigmar upon you. Let's get rid of the one unit that's not important, which is this crossbowman. And then replace him yes, with this guy. Wait, wait. I had an extra army there. This whole time and I wasn't paying attention. The land provides. Well, that's costing us money that we shouldn't be... Oh, we have Kislev under our control. Didn't notice that. Occupied Kislev. Okay. Neat. What um, what special building does Kislev have? Oh, it has the... Bohak... Bokha Palace. Neat. The Bokha Palace is the seat of the ruling Tsar. A whole wing of which is fashioned from ice magic. Nice. We have... So we basically have Moscow now. That's good. It isn't going to provide us with any income, so might as well provide us with mon with public order. Public order. Let's fight some more Dark Elves and some more Pirates. See you after the end turn. And we're back. Yes. Imperial authority is always good. So? Drill! Praise Sigma. Heirlooms of magic, come. Step to it. Get these guys in here. I trust no sight. What do you require? Shield of faith. Okay, get him up here. Onwards! We're gonna fight Orion soon, his army is pretty weak. It's high, it's high level units, but yeah. Okay, we can now get... Uh, we would want... We would like to have one of these, two of these. And we're pretty powerful on the melee front and quite decent on the range, so... Uh, yeah, one more Huntsman. And you guys continue making your way down here. The that should get them there soon. No, I'm surrounded by fools. Marcus, Let's get rid of her. There are no pirates in the area that I can see, so we can this is force march our way up there. Protector of the weak. Oh. We were replenishing faster for a while there. Let's keep this army up. Let's keep this army marching up there, so they can get there faster. I think the in I think they had some replenishment buildings, but they destroyed them. Maybe. Yeah, they definitely had some of those there, but they don't have them in any there anymore. So that's a problem. Of course. Protector of the. That there is vampire pirates. Not a not a great concern. Throg's army is up there. He said I'm not stupid. Well, we'll see about that when we see what your army is. And then I'll decide if you're stupid or not. I wanna fight you today. I'm not gonna stop the episode until you are till I've at least tried fighting you. This army is decent. It's here for he's there for replenishment. Whatever, spread public order, why not? Ah, that was the wrong skill. What technology do we have left to research? Almost nothing. Eh, 
plus in charge bonus to cavalry. We use we tend to use a lot of cavalry. See you after the end turn. Okay, turns out I was wrong and I sailed ahead without checking what was going on. So it turns out Queen Kron Hellebron has indeed attacked us here and our army is currently on force march and in very little state to deal with it, so um yeah, this episode might run a little bit long, but uh, we're going to have to fight this. Those bolt throwers are going to be annoying, but uh, we should be able to hopefully win with dark magic. We don't have much armor piercing, but yeah, let's fight it out. We're going to focus all of our fire on Crone Hellebron when she shows up. She isn't on her stupid altar of Cain, so we're going to focus fire her down and focus fire the knights. Focus fire the black guard. It's not going to be a tough fight. Their artillery is very basic. We can survive, I think. Even though there is black guard, of n even though we're in force march, not a not too big of a deal. We could also, yeah, we can hold up right here in the wa where the water is, and that way reduce the fighting effectiveness of their units. Let's, uh, yeah, hold them like this. That way they'll fight in the water, maybe like that. So they definitely find the water. Wish I'd brought some artillery of my own, but so I could devastate them before they even get to my line, but... I've defeated a, st a full-stack army of um, Black Guard of Nagarond with... and some some Shades and, and Dark Shards and stuff like that. Add with a stack of only Spearmen and Archers, so this shouldn't be too difficult. He doesn't have much, but... Oh, that's gonna help. We have a Black Arc of... Arc here nearby, so it's gonna be a little bit tough. And even if I lose this army, that's just, it's not all that big of a deal. They're gonna be moving forward very slowly. Oh, and oh, we're not on. Oh, right, we're on force march on the boat, so it doesn't matter if we don't lose the speed. The we're not tired. Yep. Ooh, that one hurt. I got a few kills, but not, but not the front line. The front line is fine. Okay, can you guys please hurry it up? Up, I don't have all day. Reaper bolt throwers are dangerous, but they'll probably be the least of my concerns. Yeah, they're gonna do damage, but fairly slowly and over time. It's not like, it's not like it's big Bess, Queen Bess. Yeah, it's doing some damage to us. Okay, yeah. Great swords! But they'll be out of ammo eventually. Death comes. Okay. Shades. Dread Spears. Okay, let's move these guys a little bit further forward so we don't take too much damage. Yeah, that. Okay, that one is homing actually, so. Focus the black guard. Okay, shoot the queen. Let's slow things down a bit. Okay, yeah, their queen is actually really powerful, but many of their units have stopped right there, so let's use that. Have these guys focus fire them. Get quite a few kills. Let's try to spirit leech her. Prepare for combat! Pick them up! How much until we get them? The Empire endures! Withdraw! Okay, we're actually with we're actually starting to lose some ground here in this fight. Crossbowman! 
Bring it down! Great swords for the Emperor! Get our mage out of there, he's our only hope. Our front line collapsed really quickly. Ready for war. Big man demands blood. Death can wait. Cross moment. Okay, yeah, we're gonna lose this fight. I was not expecting them to be that powerful. Oh well, doesn't matter in the doesn't matter in the grand scheme of things. The only armies that I'm really concerned about losing are like the ones that are back on the mainland. I mean, I recruit better battle. I can recruit better battle wizards than this guy very easily. Yeah, we've lost. I sure hope they can't claim the rune fang though. Probably not. Yeah, there I lost. Oh well, doesn't matter. I lose an army, but it doesn't matter much. She's really powerful. We're still gonna try and fight Throg, though. M maybe not today, but tomorrow, but next time maybe. Yeah, we lose. Killed in battle. Doesn't matter. Um, okay, Durthu is attacking a a garrison with the dwar help of the dwarves. Sure, goodbye, Durthu. You guys can go free. Okay, we're back. We can confederate, so sure, let's confederate with Ostland. Okay, that is one of the, yeah, now it's only Sterland that remains. Where is where are all the things I just got from the Confederation? Your Imperial authority has lessened, my lord. Yes, I know. Your lesser lords are growing more weary of your inability to command respect within the Empire. You must be more careful when dealing with Imperial matters. Yes, yes, I know. Shut up. I just got a bunch of stuff and I don't exactly know where that stuff is. I think it's up here somewhere. Do I have any new provinces? Because I just lost a new... Okay, how many armies do I have? Eleven. That's not... I, I just lost one, so I can't... Probably a good thing that I lost that army there. Okay, yeah, I would never make an army this stupid, so... March. Moving up. Watch the quarry. Goodbye. Yes, General. What does the Emperor bid? Goodbye. Yeah, goodbye. Goodbye to all of you. And there we go, back to normal. Let's go get the Throg as fast as we can. But I don't think we have the time for it today. We have a lot of new things. Yes, my lord. Oh, he resettled that location is now recruiting new units. I will marshal the men. Let us begin. Let's go take our revenge on the wood elves. Move. Summon the Elector Count. And continue our march towards the Dark Elves. Really annoying that we lost that army, but it's no harm done. Doesn't matter in the grand scheme of things, so we're pretty much just fighting enemies for fun at this point. Okay, all I need now is Hochland and Ostland. Which I should 
Oh, because of... Be to hey, you have a use. Go resettle that location. Improve that. Improve that. 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 See you after the intern. And uh, that'll probably be our last turn for the day. Okay, we are back. Someone's getting attacked by Skaven. Hm, sure. Hey, oh, it's the guys that we betrayed all those... All those turns ago. That feels like an eternity ago now. Dismiss the useless cattle. Give me money. Who called? Okay, he can start moving. He can get rid of one of these guys. Raise Sigma. There is power. Sigma heals us. What? Okay, let's By Sigma's right. take over this location. To war! Thank you. It is mine. Hello, ready. Worldly strength. Irrepressible. I that should make him much faster. Immortality. The instrument and we should be able to fight Throg then. The and, fin and end the episode after that fight. He is in Force March, has a decent enough army. I cannot cleanse the filth. Yes. He has a pretty decent army. These guys are all the heavily armored variants. Since we have Lightning Strike, I think will affect their morale a little bit. Yes. Well, I guess after that crushing defeat, we might as well have a tough fight that could possibly be winnable. I mean, his army is in Force March. He himself is a pretty big target. We should probably focus fire him and the Mammoth. It says that we would win. So, um, sure. These guys are all pretty high level, but let's fight him. Our warrior priest should be able to hold him back for a while. It's gonna be a good fight. I always wanted to know what the Lord Defeat trait for Throg is. We have these guys here. Uh, they have those Marauder Horse Masters, so it's not gonna be all that useful to send the cavalry out into the battle right away. It's pretty it's pretty good place to yeah, there's nowhere for cavalry to really hide, so let's go back a little bit. Norska looks pretty plain. Okay. We want our range units on the flank we want these units on the flanks maybe. Unbreakable ones preferably. Okay, let's um, put them all the way up here, I guess. With one of the with him here. And Fulkmar here. Escape behind them. Behind everyone currently. This will shoot one volley first. This will shoot the first volley. Get these guys behind the infantry as well. And the cavalry will stay behind and charge in later. These are knights. These are like. Knights of Moor. Let's start. And we'll be able to keep our units in the fight for long. Yeah, they're... I think their strategy is always the same of charge forward and try to win if it, as fast as possible. We just have to focus down Throg and the Mammoth if either of those things get, before either of those things get to our line. There he is. There's Throg, the Troll King. Walking by very slowly. Because he's tired. Boom! Ha ha ha! Cannon doing its job. Nine kills. We focus that. Preferable to get armor. I mean that armor. Uh, guard mode going. The 
cannons doing a good, cannons doing a good job. We don't have much anti-large, but our units say what they would do, do kind of well against them. Shoot a volley onto them. Okay, no, actually, shoot the mammoth. Okay, the mammoth has gone berserk. It routing would also be good. Shoot the lord. I said slow things down, not pause things entirely. Okay, yeah, got those guys there. If I use this here, okay, yeah, the trolls are retreating already. Hey, overcast it, this should help. Shoot them. Great swords! Ready for war! Sigma speaks through me! Get him in there. My Sigma! Get this cavalry to get out of there. Okay, shoot anything that is possible to be shot. Are not really anti large, but they should handle themselves well against that for the one for the time being. Okay, get Volkman out of there and back in. Okay, yeah, those guys are getting hit. So let's give them some armor to sound like this, right? But they're not. You guys shoot those guys. Give them a good buff. Of heal them up a bit here. Let's wait a bit. Army losses. Oh. That would explain why these guys have been taking so much damage. I, I'd really use those guys very poorly in this fight. Reinforce that flank. Let's see about Volkmar a bit. Charge into there. I had to, if I'd use these guys correctly, I kind of forgot about them. I thought they were being used correctly. Yep. 
Shoot them there. That was an easy fight. I'm much better at fighting all melee armies than I'm fighting thing ranger armies. Okay, let's get our heal let's get our units together. Heal the These guys would have been done such a better job if they hadn't charged forward like melee cavalry and continue and instead continued bombarding the enemy with their um grenade launches. Okay, we lose one guy. Everybody heals up. He miscasts, no big deal. Vol Volkmar has regeneration, doesn't he? Oh, he had 52% uh, into ward save. At the okay, he, he has 30 percent ward save, that's why he was not dying all that well. With this, he, with this he gets, uh, yeah, he can get quite a lot of ward save. But, yeah, but he does have regeneration. Let's heal up the Battle Priest, who did a decent job holding the line and improving our units. There we go, everyone's healed. Another battle. Pyrrhic victory. Well, yeah, sure, but we had a decent, decent army. Cavalry did really well. Volkmar did well. I really wanted to use Volkmar again as well. Haven't used him in quite a while. Let's see what the trade is for defeating. Okay, yeah, we only lose one unit. That's good. We will occupy because I need to replenish. Yeah, quite a lot of replenishment. Let's see here. Can we... We'll take three turns, but yeah, that's also how long it will take for him to recover. Oh, Troll Hunter. That's the buff. Plus 15 in the anti-large and 3% weapon strength. That's immense. That's a uh, because this also this not only affects damage but it also affects um, melee attacks. So that when fighting a large target, he has a lot of yeah he has a uh, plus 15 anti infantry and plus 15 anti large. So he has quite a lot of chances of actually hitting large targets. That makes him really useful now. Good, an oddity among his kind. Throck is nothing if not tenacious. He he won't stay down for long. Good. That was a really good battle and a really good trait. Got to remember to hunt down Throg with other generals then. Oh well. Hope you all enjoyed this episode. If you did, leave a like, leave a comment, subscribe for more. Hope hope you all enjoyed. See you next time. Farewell.